Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here's my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look, each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world. My core belief that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the Great Commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good morning. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an author and addiction recovery coach, a life coach, a minister, and the host of this show. Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube under channel Take Your Life Back Today show. Besides an iHeartRadio, iTunes, Google Music, Amazon Music, and other digital platforms available to you. Listen, I want to uh, ask you, do you ever feel like the world is just crashing down around you? Like if one more thing goes wrong, you will collapse under the weight of it all. If that is where you are right now, watching and listening to me, God wants to remind you that you are supposed to look to him when you are weary. It doesn't matter what it is. Jesus calls us to come to him when we are weary and burdened. In Matthew eleven twenty eight. as followers, we shouldn't wait until it feels like we have the time We need to make the time at all times for God. Let me encourage you like I do myself in every day. Take some time to pray or open the Bible and read his word. Listen to some worship music. And as soon as you turn to Christ, you will feel so much better. You see, when we take that time to come to him, he gives us rest. He lifts the weights of off of our shoulders and reminds us that it really is in his hands and that we need to trust him. That doesn't mean that everything will be okay, that everything will be downhill from there. It just reminds us that no matter how many bad things happen in our lives, he will never leave us or never forsake us. Call me at 844 You and I, we can help each other take our lives back today. Remember to always smile for that neighbor or for anyone because it will do good for them and it'll do good for you. I always say when you help other people, you help yourself. When you help other people, you serve the Lord. And when you serve the Lord, you're in his good graces. May God bless you. Have a great life with Jesus Christ in your life. And we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. And remember, God truly loves you. Never forget that because he really, really wants you to come to him for everything.